So the Cessnock and Curry area is referred to as the coal fields. That's, that's how they're known. Also known for their wineries, but traditionally they're called the coal fields. And that's because this area was really founded on, on underground coal mining. Now, for that coal mining to happen, they needed the forests on the surface because they needed pit props and railway sleepers to support the infrastructure to keep those mines going. So whilst elsewhere in the Hunter Valley, the, the forests were cleared, these forests around Cessnock were actually retained to keep these, these coal mines going. So I think that's a really important part of our cultural, European cultural history, that we have really the coal mines to thank for what's now like in, incredible remnant forest just teeming with threatened species. So there's real opportunities to promote bushwalking and other activities in our remnant bushland in, in Werikata National Park. Uh, to date, there hasn't really been any information available. The people in the Tourist Information Centre will actually tell you that we don't promote bushwalking around Cessnock at the moment because there's you know, all these threats that are, you know, we have illegal firewood cutting, uh, we have arson, we have rubbish dumping. So, so currently, you know, we, we're not in a position to be able to promote the area, but the more we appreciate it, I think, I really think that you know, the, the more care we give the bushland, the more people will come, the more we'll be able to produce maps and, and tell people where they can go and experience this, this wonderful bushland.